A lifetime ago, I felt the power of the Void through Dowd. All of us who were close to him could do unnatural things. Move from rooftop to rooftop in the blink of an eye. Fall on our enemies and slit their throats, like shadows sharpened to a fine edge. I made Dunwall bleed for all it had done to me, to the ones I loved. Now the Outsider has given that back, for reasons I don't understand. But it feels good. We killed so many rich bastards who thought nothing of hurting us, it felt like justice. Is the Outsider to blame for what we did? Does corruption come from the Void? Or from our own hearts? Witches and charlatans wearing necklaces of fingers and teeth. Cities sliding into chaos. Now the Eyeless peddle black magic in the streets while their leaders keep even more dangerous secrets locked away. They've got a relic that turned a boy into a god centuries ago. A knife that might be the only way to destroy that god. The outsider knows I intend to steal it. Does he know what else I intend to do? You gave me this for luck, my sweet Deirdre. I don't know if it's ever worked that way, but maybe it will this time. Hmm. I'm ready to rob the bank. It didn't kill him before. It made him into a god. Then, it can unmake him. The bank is owned and managed by Dolores Michaels. I've cased the place and talked to some people, and there are a few ways inside. Others have tried and failed to rob it before. They didn't have the focus we do. We're not after coin. How do you plan to get inside? There are three possible ways. The roof, the trash disposal, and the sewers. All of them might work. Once I'm in, I need to find the vault. The knife must be in there. The security in the bank will be high. What have you learned? Not much. Guards, clockwork soldiers, and a lot of locked doors that can only be opened remotely. And that's all before I'd reach the vault itself. There's an intake port on the roof that leads to the bank's ventilation system. If you find enough laudanum, most of the bank's security will be dazed before you even get inside. There was a pharmacy in the district, but it's been seized by the bank. I'll see what I can find. I know how resourceful you can be. These keys you found with the eyeless leaders will lead you to whatever holds the knife. You'll also need the bank manager's key. Deal with her how you see fit. Then I'm ready. Good. I... <clears throat> <clears throat> do you want me to stay? No. There's nothing you can do for me here. Go get the knife. Kill the outsider. I trust you to finish this. I will, Dowd. One way or another. You've seen more than most. What we did years ago. The witches who tried to take the throne. The eyeless keeping me in that pit. But I've been to the Void, Billy. All the bitterness, hatred, and fear. And the Outsider gets to choose who wields his black magic, and who cowers in the dark. That's something no one should decide. Do you really think he's to blame for all of that? For what we all did? The Outsider gave me his mark, knowing what I could do with that kind of power. For years, I carved up Dunwall from the inside, until it fell apart. The world doesn't need more men like me. After hours, it should just be night guards, a handful of accountants, and Dolores Michaels herself. When you have the knife, 
Find out where the Eyeless make their headquarters. That will bring you one step closer to the Outsider's throat. I won't see what the world becomes when the Outsider dies. It's strange to see you change like this, but... I know you're still my Billy. And I trust you. When you have the knife, you have to find a way to reach the Void. I'm sure the Eyeless know. When you find the Outsider in the Void, end him. The guards the use authorization codes over a public announcement Without system to issue orders, bastard, but it changes every shift. Giving out his magic there's no to the way to find him out without going in. Those codes will be useful to reach the most sensitive parts of the bank. I know you'll be able to find them one way or another. They say cursed spirits wander the void. I've wandered this world long enough. Leave me, Billy. I can't do anything for you. Go. You know the knife is in the bank vault. I've never seen doubt so weak. I might never see him again. Jacoby murdered in cold blood. Blood flies never stay caged for long. Serves her right.
Bravo. Pretty sure I saw. Maybe I should pay Theresia a visit. Good evening, Michael's deposit of blood. I'm here to make a withdrawal. You aren't going anywhere! Come on! No! Damn it! Sorry, Sal. I know you've got it under control. I'm just worried about those guards we saw earlier. Huh? What the? Oh, there's no, no need to point that at my face, stranger. I feel like talking.
People are offering rewards. Greetings. I provide only the finest service with absolute discretion. An excellent choice. I took over the shop recently. The previous owner had an accident. <clears throat> I'm certain you'll be satisfied with your purchase. Outsider. The bank sent you, didn't they? Well, sorry to disappoint you, but I've got nothing left. You can't bleed whale oil from a bone. Tell your trustees that! I'm not from the bank. I saw that your father's pharmacy closed. Do you know where else I can find laudanum? Yes. The auction house. My father used to distill laudanum by hand from a secret family recipe. Poppy tincture, he called it. Better than factory made. But the bank's selling that along with all of his other worldly possessions. They took everything we had. I'm sorry for your loss. I've read he was murdered. Do you know anything? His body was completely drained of blood when the Grand Guard found him. I've no idea why anyone would want to hurt Father. Anyway, the auction's today. You better hurry. And wear a hat or something. The guards won't let you in looking like... that. Trouble sleeping again last night. Maybe I ought to try one of those sleeping tinctures, but they can be kind of pricey. I told her if you want my advice, just pay the fine and be done with it. No use making trouble. It's not funny. lot looks promising. That wild painting, striking. I can't go Not in there looking like this. I need to find another face. Probably. 
Really there was too much. Where did, am I going crazy? <sighs> mm. Two coins for that I'm cat lab? Well, no more, I thank you. Place is a dump like anyway. <clears throat> How hard can it be to clean a few things? Uh, Honestly, why do I need for a house full of servants when they don't do anything? Long overdue for a day to myself to do whatever I want. Myself. <clears throat> But then again, it's just been one I have such a twingy back. And the season's just getting started. You feel a special kind of loneliness when the world treats you like filth. Please, please don't hurt me. I'm nobody. What do you want from me? foreclosures, there have been some choice items on the block these days. Hey! Someone there? You think you're so supreme? I'll fill my pillow with your.
I doubt I can help you, whatever you want. I'll be laughing over Rum about how you die. Ooh. Damn you! should be able to open the hatches.
Easy. Now for the difficult part. I need to stay quiet. They could still wake up if I make too much noise. I should be able to open some doors from here.
must be the vault. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A control room can move the vault into two places. I need to find a way to move that thing, one way or another. Secrets to Lois. How did you do that? You filth! No! You shouldn't have done that! What's happening now?
Uh... Dolores Michaels likes to keep all her secrets where she can see them. I wonder if Father would approve of the security. Hey. What else is she hiding? They know a way into the void. Cienfuegos sent Isla's documents to the Royal Conservatory. I need to find out what he knew. The Conservatory is my next step. mining camp in the mountain but it's not right it's been changed by the void it doesn't exist or shouldn't This is what I needed.
Wake up. I need you to let me in. Huh? Outsider's eyes. If Pena caught me sleeping on the job, he'd make me run the shock lock. <clears throat> May I have the code, please? It's B15D. Now let me in. Okay, okay. Come on in. And uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell Chief Pena about my attention lapse. They didn't forget the codes. We wouldn't have a problem. know it's missing until it's too late. Two locks. This has to be the one. You and I were both abandoned to uncertain futures on dangerous streets and taken in by murderers. Dowd spared your life all those years ago, but I was taught a lesson that you still haven't learned. Some will stay with you, even in the void. Give it to me. I don't have time for this. Time repeats the same unending patterns. Four thousand years ago, this knife cut my name away. Forgotten forever. You know what it's like to lose one name and live with another. We are all made by the things that are taken from us. I've seen the people you've twisted with your poisonous magic. You know what I want. You know I'm coming for you. I know more than most. I know that time is bleeding into itself around you. I know that you have felt it, and you are searching for the places where the world has broken against the void. I know that doubt is done when you left him on your ruined ship, 
and you will carry that knife with you to face me at the black center of all things. Why are you doing this? Why are you talking to me now? I'm here because you are different. The Void has found you through the cracks in your broken life. And when you cut me out of it, what will remain? What will you leave behind when you walk away? What does the Outsider want from me? Doubt. Is he really gone? I have the knife. I need to get back to the Dreadful Will. The streets should be crawling with guards by now. Nothing I can't handle. Oh. Uh. They're suspicious. Uh. 
Ah! <sighs> 